preview up test mode and run mode guys so uh, right here we have uh, three three types of previewing up and uh, this is test mode is basically debug mode when you can uh, where you can just uh, run it in test mode uh, fix some problems fix some bugs in your project make um, reload and see how it works so let's start from the beginning preview up I have have it here already preloaded what it for basically it's it working like a prototyping so when you using preview up you can see only the um, UI components that working together how it works and uh, right here you have access to all of your um, pages you can check how every different component work but the one thing that preview up is uh, not working with database data so basically this is just uh, interface interactions that, that you can uh, check in the project uh, this is good for prototyping when you building just a prototype from the design that you had from uh, designer for example you have something uh, all the in, all interface in Figma and you need to build it in inside Flutter flow you can just quickly check it in preview up also you have canvas sizes here you can see how it works with different uh, screen sizes the same thing that we have on the scaffold in our project you can just drag everything that you need you can uh, use basically yeah display keyboard the same thing how works everything and you can share the preview up to other people so next thing is test mode so this is a little lightning button um, just building test mode it looks like this so uh, I just pre-builded it it's not loaded properly yet but the main thing that test mode and run mode building around two or four minutes but in test mode you have ability to uh, make instant reload so for example uh, when you find the bug in your project in your application you can just uh, fix it real real quick real quick here so make some uh, difference and then you click in instant reload it will take around 10 seconds 10 15 seconds and then your application is uh, build it you see how fast it is uh, build it with all the changes changes that you did before like you fixed your bug and now you can check it one more time uh, <coughs> you can end the debug session the same thing here canvas size you can see how it works uh, in adaptive uh, design and that's basically it. the main the main thing of test mode is debug guys so uh, it's better to use test mode rather than run mode because run mode you will not be able to make instant reload and uh, see which changes you you did so next is run mode so let's talk about this is uh, the build that lives uh, forever so for example you can copy this link and if you have presentation of your project you can just uh, use this link just paste it into your browser and uh, you can use your, your application almost like in like on the device so basically you are you are not able to make some um, fixes so you can fix it in the project but you will not be able to reload it to uh, see all fixes you need to use uh, test mode for that uh, right here you just uh, can see how your application working well one more thing test mode and run mode 
working with database connections. So all the information that you have in your database will be shown here. So that's it. That's all we have with our debug mode, test, run, and preview app mode.